I'm going to show you how to use all the new iOS 10 messages features that come with a free update to your iPhone and iPad. I'm Josh Smith with GotToBeMobile.com. Type out a message and then tap on the emoji button and it's going to identify emoji replacements that you can tap on. And if you tap on these, you'll start to replace them. You can change the way you send your messages. Force touch on the send button on a newer iPhone and then you can choose to slam. You can be loud, you can be gentle, or you can send it in invisible ink and someone has to swipe over to see that message. Now you can also send screen effects. So we have balloons, we have confetti, you can say it with lasers, fireworks, and we also have a shooting star. So once you get the one you want, you can tap send here and it will send it and you'll see the effect on your phone and they'll see the effect on theirs. If you want to reply to someone without actually typing something, you can send a tap back. So tap and hold on a message and then you can heart, thumbs up, thumbs down, haha, exclamations or question mark. And that will show up as a little message right next to that message. If you tap this little arrow over here on the left, you'll pull up an option so that you can quickly send a photo that you see or send one from your photo library. Now with this option, you can also tap here and this is gonna pull up a way to send digital touch and you can draw and then tap or you can basically send your heartbeat, send a broken heart. There's all kinds of little things you can send and this isn't sending my actual heartbeat like from the Apple Watch but it's an interesting little feature that you can do and that will send it as a little message there. You can also use iMessage apps. You tap on this little app store and it'll pull up the apps you have. This one is a free app called Truth Truth Lie. It records three video clips, combines them and sends them and people in your message group have to guess if they're a truth or a lie. You can also send some of your recently played music or tell people what you are listening to and there will be many more. You can also find images and videos. These are some of the built-in ones and one free one. In iOS 10, you can send a handwritten message. Now, the easiest way to do this is to put your phone in landscape mode, and then you can choose a message that you want to send if you want it to look really pretty, or you can put your own and hit done and hit send. This will appear like it's being written out on the other person's screen.